Welcome back to Live at 5 at 4. I'm Emily DeVoe. For one East Tennessee family, donating blood is about more than just giving up 15 minutes of your day. It's a chance for them to say thank you to the community that helped them when they needed it most. My daughter uh, texts me and said, Dad is not feeling well. He's on his way home. What started as a normal day for the Landis family in 2013. I was given a 9% chance of survival. Changed the course of their lives forever. And we all want to believe that it can't happen to us, but it can. David Landis had just dropped his daughter off at real estate school. When he started feeling ill, 24 hours later, he was on life support, suffering from pancreatitis. My pancreas uh, basically shut down, started to rot inside of my body and poisoned all my other abdominal organs. Doctors told his wife, Yavanka, he needed blood and a lot of it. So friends, family, and complete strangers showed up to donate. And I looked at those people and they were, a lot of them were strangers to me. And I said, if they can take out time of their families, their jobs, and all those type things to come save my husband's life, who am I not to do the same thing? After David recovered and returned home, his family couldn't shake the feeling of giving back to those who had helped them. It was important to her. Over the course of the next year, when I started to realize what I'd been through and how lucky I was to have survived, it's when it became important to me. They decided to host another blood drive, this time not for them, but for others. Here's purpose, here's a legacy that we can build together as a family. Seven years later, that legacy is an annual tradition every first week in November, with the Landis family coming up with ways to attract more blood donors every year. Just about everybody's gonna go home with a, a gift card or a door prize, something, uh, coupons, t-shirts, we have a entertainment. A lot of times we'll have local celebrities in. People keep going and they just really build a bond and they come together every year. There's some that literally calls each other and says, hey, what time are you going to the blood drive? That's amazing. This is the eighth year for the Keeping the Dave Landis Miracle Alive blood drive. They'll be set up on Wednesday outside of Petro's on Kingston Pike between 930 and 530. It comes at a time when Medic is in great need of donations. It's a great way to give back.